Here's an example of what a shop page could look like. It has all of the active packages, as well as logo and a one liner about your shop and what you have to offer. It also shows your terms and conditions and will also show how to log in as a client. Now let's go back to the back end. So if we go to the packages here, you'll see that all three packages I have here are active. Now let's say that I didn't want it to show on my shop page. What I can do is I can modify it and I can have it as invite only. So only those with the direct link will be able to purchase this package or pause so no one will be able to purchase it. Both of these settings will make it so that they don't appear on the shop page. Let's save this to just show you how it looks. Now, if we go back here and we refresh, you'll see that there's just the two packages left here. Now, each of these individual packages that are active can be modified within the packages themselves. So if we go to packages and we say go to discovery call and we go over here to the landing page setting. This is where you'll be able to add a cover image and add a teaser overview. Now, this is the information that is showing up directly here. And this is also the image that's showing up here. One note is that I would recommend resizing the images to the same size in advance. This way, they'll appear all the same across and each section will be approximately the same, making it have a really nice feel. Okay, that's it for your shop page. See you out there.